Hey there, LT Zeta here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Metroid Prime 2. In the last episode, we got a translator module and super missiles, and in this episode, we're gonna put both to good use, I assume. Do some scanny bobanny. The path below to these howled grounds is mine to follow. Okay. I feel like I'm I'm using the scanner button. I don't know if it's like my controller or what. But things keep like deleting themselves off of my screen before I have a chance to read them. Engulf me, plant. Hmm. Is this gonna take me? is regular missile, correct? Yes. This is it a recharge station or a save station? Okay, I found another save station. I'll accept that. Oh, it's both. Energy and... Were they always both? I feel like Prime 1 at least had separate save stations. I don't know. Alright, neat. I found a save station. Oh, there's a lot of gates that I completely missed, and one of them is tri triangular. How did I miss every single one? Oh, that, the triangular one is a gate up. Oh, that's where I came in from. That's the elevator, then. Yeah. So I went up, so how do I go down, then? I guess they did say it was all underwater. Uh, I don't like that I fell all the way down. <laughs> ah! Blah, blah, blah. Please don't push me off, that would be rude. Ah, that shoots me all the way back up. That's from Super Metroid. I recognize that song. That's neat. Yeah. 
Okay. I know some Metroidy things. Mostly I know that song because I used it for a Sporkle quiz. <laughs> but, hey, it's something, right? Slightly to the left. Lore here. <laughs> okay, so I can't reach that ledge from here. Oh, there's a blue door at the bottom. That's probably where I need to go. I don't think I can jump anything. away. So unless I'm supposed to just drop onto those platforms, I don't know how to get to the blue door down there. Because like, there's a blue door down there, but I don't see a way of actually getting there, because I think it's inside the giant thing in the center. So if I shoot myself back up... I know I can't really reach the white door easily. Let's see if I can maybe reach the black door? No, I can't jump that. I don't get it.
Yeah, I can't even double jump. Oh, wait. What is this? Alright, here's what I've been missing. That's what I've been missing. Okay. Things like that. I guess that explains why I didn't find that one, because, like, it's hard to see things down here. And I went, and I kind of, I guess I must have just assumed that all, th all those platforms were the same. Right, so, which one of these things did I open up, then? The purple one? I can't do the purple yet. I can't go this way! Alright, so I must still be missing other things to disengage. Which are these ones! Alright, so I think that I'm supposed to come back here. I don't really want to come back here, but I think I'm supposed to because I can't make those jumps and the other things that are there are things that I can't reach. Just straight up. I can't reach the black and white doors. I need to come at those from the other side. And that's where the other disengagey lock thingies are. Now and I look at it more closely and understand what it's all doing. So because I can't actually do that, that means I need to come back here from a later point. So I'm assuming that I get there through another method, which is... Back up the other thing, because, you know, obviously there was a plenty of, like, other translator things that I could do that I did not do yet. So, I'm going to go and actually do a cutaway. <laughs> I know, big surprise. I'm going to go back to that main room and find the first green teleporter thingy, translator thing, that I have not done yet. So, I'll meet you guys there. Okay, I actually did not go this way yet. Let's see what's this way. This is not exactly what I said I was going to cut to, but... Fighting you in closed space is not exactly fun. Why did my... I feel like there's something wrong with my nunchuck, because, like, I'm holding the C button down to lock on, and it doesn't really stay locked on. And I think that's probably why... I'm also ha You know what? Fuck it, I don't care. That's probably why I'm having problems where, like, I go through a thing. try to scan something and like it just unstops scanning. I didn't even realize there were turrets in there. Well, whatever, I'll deal with them when I come back. Music has changed.
kind of ominous, honestly. Doom and evil. Really rude of you to do and make it so that I have a hard time seeing. Like, it's smart. I'm not gonna say no, but it's also really rude. I mean, I know we're trying to kill each other, but the least you could do is be nice about it. just space pirate guys. I guess they're not- they feel like space pirates, but I think they're technically Ing or whatever the alien guys are. portal here. Alrighty then. Let's hop on in, I guess. This isn't really what I was expecting, but I'm here now. Can't go forward, even though that's where the original door was. There are mushrooms up there, but I don't. I can't reach those. Oh, I can reach this one though. I can reach this one. Okay. Doing some weird fancy tree climbing. Awkward, like not really knowing the layout of the room too well and needing to like look up Like looking up is just awkward in a first-person game like this sometimes I mean looking around can sometimes just be awkward in a game like this All right, there's a save point right here excellent the more of these I find, the better.
Alright, so... That's just a save point in the middle of everything. Okay, so this is where I'm going. Okay. I was gonna say, like, why didn't I do anything here? This is where I've already been. So where am I going? I keep getting completely turned around. So there's a wall here. I can't reach. Look, look, I didn't really want to do this game. You, you forced my hand. I'm slowly dying. I don't have much else to do. Oh! I wonder if I'm gonna get like a boost ball. Okay, I'm definitely getting the boost ball soon. <laughs> Thank you for answering my question. So succinctly and so, like, immediately, like, couldn't have asked for a better answer, honestly. Alright. I'm gonna be f I re cause I remember I fought the Jump Guardian thingy in the Who's It way back when. So I'm assuming, like, this is like a Boost Guardian, cause it looked the same. I, I remember seeing that guy. The only reason why I'm being slow is because, like, if I'm going to be fighting a boss soon, I want my health fully restored. Like, this is what I dislike about this area. It's just that, like, it feels kind of slow like this. Because, like, you're constantly taking damage and then needing to heal damage. Like, I just... That's what I dislike about this area so far. Like, the, the concept of Dark Aether is neat. But I don't like needing to constantly, like, recharge health like that. Also, yep, boost guardian it is. I have completely lost track of it. this is what I'm supposed to do, but like the whole sc screen changed when I did this. Okay. Alright, it's doing this again. I think I'm, like, supposed to, like, attack- yeah, I'm- I'm attacking, like, the goop. I don't know if I'm supposed to do that with anything, or... I'm not ent I'm entirely sure how to, like, get it to turn into that goop, but, like, I I'm succeeding enough.
Alright. Come on, reveal yourself. You're almost dead, let me kill you. Yeah, it doesn't seem to take damage from anything other than work ball bombs. Come on, ricochet into this already. Give me health. I'm running low. How have you managed to miss it every single time? Right here, buddy. Come on! <laughs> Hit it already! Just a few more shots, and this thing's down. Oh, you, you went back to this phase already? Did I accidentally, like, skip a phase or something when I, like... Shot you with super missiles? I don't know. Dot be leap do. I know my energy's low. I'm trying to kill this thing. Please let me just kill you. There we go. You're dead. Imagine if you died during this death animation. Whew. That could have been better. Glad I got that extra energy tank, all things considered. Alright, I have boost ball now. Excellent. Okay. Let's get out of here. Game momentum on the half pipe. Do I want to? There's like nothing here. But there might be like a thing up top, I guess. Up oh, there is a thing up top. I think that's one of the keys. Why can't I get it? Right, well, let me let me line myself up properly for it. Yeah, okay. So it should be right about here-ish. There we go. 
That's one of the three temple keys. Chicka, chicka, chicka. Cool beans. Oh, that took me backwards. I am pressing the wrong button. There we go. I was like, how do I get out of here now? I forgot that this was even going to be a thing. Wow, way to not work, Hoosball. There we go. Yeah, my energy's low. I need to hang out in a cool thing. Alright. Um, so I can't actually leave through there. There's a save point nearby, though, and that will refill me. This guy will refill me. So... Hmm. I did just beat a boss, and I have saved. My energy is fully replenished, and I have saved. This isn't exactly as far as I wanted to get when I heard about the three keys, but honestly, this might be the best place to end for me right now. Because I've got an idea of where I need to go. I can't go here. Because I can't really leave there, I don't think. I didn't really fully explore, but I don't think I can leave there. I think I'm gated off. But if I go back to the regular portal and go back into this portal, I think I can go to the green door now. And there's other translation things that I haven't quite done yet, you know? So, I think that's the general gist of what I want to be doing. So, I think next time on Let's Play Metroid Prime 2, uh, next time on Let's Play Metroid Prime 2, get it? I echoed it. <laughs> um, we're gonna go and try and see if we can get at least one of the other keys, if not both of them, in the next episode. I'll see you guys next time for more Metroid Prime 2. That echo was not intentional. But hey! I'm back playing this game, baby. And that's pretty exciting.